you take one minute to acknowledge the presence of the Lord in this place? Can you take one minute and acknowledge the presence of God in this place? Can you thank Him? Can you thank the Lord? He is in this, in this place. The Lord is in this place. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for your presence. Thank you for your presence, Holy Spirit. Take over. Take over, Holy Spirit. Take over, Holy Spirit. Can we clap our hands for Jesus? Can we make some noise for Jesus? Can we make some noise for Jesus? Rekelebo sete, Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Can you shout out the name of Jesus? Can you shout out the name of Jesus? Rekelebo sata. If you are here today, if you are here today, it's because of Him. So thank you is the least of the things that you can do. Just say thank you, Jesus. Thank you for everything. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Today it's a special Sunday. But next Sunday it will be a, a special more special hallelujah amen. Amen. amen as you heard in the announcements Comme for those who were here but uh, at the end fin, we'll put a video, on va une video of the angel of the house de la, de la pastor daniel himself pastor daniel tell you, telling you something Il va te dire chose. Amen. amen so you heard the program Next week will be a bit. Uh, the program will change a little bit. So on Tuesday and on Wednesday, if you are servant here at Logos Swim myself, we will meet at our other branch in Randburg. But Thursday and Friday, all of us. We will meet there Nous at the north, at Randburg. As Brother Grace said, Comme, uh, if, you have, like if you have a, pr a problem transport, a, tr uh, a, tr a transport problem, si vous avez un problème de transport, just speak to us, uh, par register. Uh, at the end, if you want to come, please give your name to Brother Grace. Si tu veux venir, tu peux ton nom à, à Frère Grace. The one who's just waved. We will take your name and we will make sure that you will have your own Uber for you and your family only to be there. And for Sunday, next Sunday, we will not meet here, but I will leave you the video at the end. And then after the video, I'll just comment a little bit. So we bless the Lord for his presence. You can have your seat. We bless the Lord for his presence in this place. We bless the Lord for your presence in this place. We bless the Lord for the angel of the house, Pastor Daniel. Who will come next week. He will be with us. And not uh, this Thursday, Tuesday, but the following Tuesday. We will have a big event here. With himself, Pastor Daniel, the choir and everything. We will have a big Tuesday worship experience. Hallelujah. So don't miss on Tuesday. As I say, I will make sure that if you have a transportation problem, we will fix that. By the way, we will have all your numbers. I think we all, but we will take all the numbers to do the follow-up. I'm sure that my Brother Grace is already in alert. Amen. 
So today's theme topic is you have God's DNA. Say to your neighbor, I have God's DNA. La DNA de Dieu. Amen. Amen. You have God's DNA. Tu as la DNA. Recently, I was listening to a, a man of God, a, a, a worshiper. Récemment, je, j'écoutais un homme de Dieu, un adorateur. Her name, his name is Kirk Franklin. Son nom est Kirk Franklin. He, he did a, a documentary, a documentary. Il a fait un docu- documentaire. About his life, his father. And the name of the, that documentary, is, uh, the name is Father's Day. Et le titre du documentaire était uh, Journée de, des Pères. Fête des yeah. Pères. So he was explaining il how, a man, how he grew up il a grandi, from house to house. Uh, and uh, one day, one of, uh, a member of his family passed away. In that um, funeral, Et dans, uh, dans ces a man came. And he said to one of the aunts or the cousin of Kirk Franklin that, uh, you know what? Tu sais quoi? Uh, when Kirk Franklin was born, Quand Kirk Franklin était né, in that a period, cette période, I was dating a mom. En train de avec sa mère. And I don't know, but I'm ready if, you want, if we want a DNA test, I'm ready for that. Meanwhile, the, the, the father who was supposed to be the who was saying that he was the father of Kirk Franklin was passed away already. Passed away already. Amen. Amen. So that guy just came and said that. Cet homme est venu et il a juste so Kirk Franklin ça. went to his mom and said, Mom, what happened? A man just said that he's, maybe he's my father. The mother said, never, never, never. You know, as mother, we know the fathers, always. No. She said, no, no, it's not your father. Your father is the one who passed away, so it's not your father. But Kirk Franklin was not, you know, at ease. It was just trouble in his mind. And he asked for a DNA test. Why that guy? Pourquoi cet homme in that funeral, dans, uh, ces funerailles, said to dit, that cousin or that family member that cousin, in famille, that period I was dating Kirk Franklin's mother. Dans cette période, je, en train de avec you know I am ready if you want to do a DNA test. test. Why? Pourquoi? Because he was looking at himself Parce qu'il se and he checked at that boy. The mama never said that this is your son. Because he was, it was the son of someone else. But when I look at him, it looks like he looks at me. The way he's doing this thing, it's, it's maybe, it can be. So he just said it like that. But Kirk Franklin went, go, went and did the DNA test. And the DNA came 99 something percent. So that man was the biological father of Kirk Franklin. Just to make you laugh, the mother said, no, it's not your father. I'm telling you, he's not the father. They did another test. 99.9 something percent. That man was the biological father of Kirk Franklin. Amen. But why did they do the the DNA tests? Because the DNA test will give you the genetic information. It means that in the DNA, it's the it put the, the DNA puts together your gene. The the hereditary um, trait that you are giving back, the features that you are giving from the father to the the, the parent to the children. Those genes, those things those thing that you are giving to them, by God mystery, we, we can say, but it's just something else. That you can see Mama Zano. And you see a daughter, Shanice. 
Even if I didn't tell you that this is the daughter of that, if I just put the child here, you will say this is the mother because of the features. Same. And the Lord and the, 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 the gene, so we are passing by our gene. And how we can, um, so now when you go for the DNA test, they go now to analyze the, the gene markers, the genetic markers. And then when they will analyze that probability, they will take it in percentage and they will say that because we analyze your genes, the probability shows that this person is the biological father and not the other one. And we now, the Bible say, in Ephesians chapter 1 verse 13, I want you to have that, you know, the, the gene and DNA and everything. Because in Ephesians chapter 1 verse 13, said, I want you to read with me in French. Ephesians 1 chapter 13, the Bible says, And you also were included in Christ when you heard the message of truth, the gospel of your salvation. When you believed, you were marked, marked in him with a seal, the promised Holy Spirit. Ephesians chapter 1, verse 13. Yes. So you will catch up with the next, next verse. But just prepare yourself to read all the verses in French. So in other words, the Lord is saying that when we heard the message of truth, we heard the gospel, the fact that we were in the darkness, and now by his blood, he gave his life, for us to go now in the kingdom of Jesus, for us to become children of God, we were lost and now we are found. We were dying because of our sin. Now we have eternal life because of the sacrifice of Jesus. His blood flowed through our veins. We are children of God. When you believe it, and you say, Lord, I give you, you give you, you give him your old man, you give him your old nature. And you, and you accept his, you accept his nature, you accept what he did on the cross. You accept, you accept the sacrifice. He give you his life. Now you have the eternal life. You are born again. You are a new creature. When you heard the, the, the gospel, when you believe in it, when you take it from, for you, now you are a new creature. What the Lord will come, will do, it will seal. It will seal whatever you did with his Holy Spirit. With what, what um, made God God. The very nature of God. He will put it inside of you. He will take his DNA. He will put it inside of you. He will take his nature. He will take it. He will put it inside of you. Now you can go and do the DNA test. To know who is your heavenly father. Who is your father. Your true father. And the test will tell you. It's hundred percent, hundred and hundred and Jesus. It's hundred percent God. The test will tell you that you are a son of God. This is why the Holy Spirit testifies to you, and He's telling you that you are a son of God. That you are a son of God. Can we clap our hands for Jesus? Relebo City. The Lord sealed us with the Holy Spirit. He put his very nature. So now people can see your father through you. Now people can see the features of your father in your life. The Bible says in the book of Romans chapter 8 verse 29. Romans chapter, Romans chapter 8 verse 29. 
Romans chapter 8 verse 29, 29. For God knew his people in advance. And he chose them to become like his son. Amen. So when he chose you. It is for you to become like his son. As he is. You are in this world. But what can we see? Because when I see a father, I can see some genes, you know. I can see the, the, the eyes, the way the eyes are. I can see even the, the way sometimes we are taking some weight. It's in the genes sometimes, you know. This is the father's gene or the mother's gene. You know, when you see someone and you can say, mm -mm, this is his father. This is a mother. You can say that. But now for us, what are, what are those genes? What are we talking about when we talk about the gene? So Galatians chapter 5 verse 22 says, But the fruit of the Spirit, le, but the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, long-suffering, patience, gentleness, la gentillesse, goodness, faith, meekness, temperance, self-control. Against such there is no law. So, the fruit is, well, then they say, and if, I don't know if you even noticed, because I say the fruit of the spirit, and she said in French, she put it in plural, les fruits de l'esprit. The Bible said the fruit, talking about one fruit, talking about love, and then it's telling us other fruit. Why the Bible said the fruit of the Spirit? Because we know that the Holy Spirit is like, you know, grammar is not a Holy Spirit problem. But the Holy Spirit said the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, patience, meekness, self-control. Why? Because in one correction, and I want you, maybe tomorrow your children will ask you, you must be able to give that answer. Because in 1 Corinthians chapter 13, verse 5, verse 4, 1 Corinthians chapter 13, verse 4, the Bible says, Love is patient. Love is kind. It does not envy. It does not boast. It's not proud. It's not rude. It's not self-seeking. It's not self-angered. It keeps no record of wrong. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. All the description that we just read are, give, are telling us what the love is. It's like if 1 Corinthians chapter uh, 13 is like the definition of love. Now in that definition, you can find patience. In that definition, you can find self-control. In that... Maîtrise de soi. In that definition, you can find joy. In that definition, you can find kindness. You can, you can find all the things that we are said in uh, Galatians chapter 5, verse 22. You find it in the definition of love. So this is why they say lo, uh, the fruit of the spirit is love and then it's giving the manifestation of love, the different manifestation of love. It means that, in other words, when you receive your DNA, when the Lord put himself inside of you, inside of you, you have love. Inside of you now you have joy, you have kindness, you have peace, you have self-control. This is why sometimes when you pray, Lord, give me peace, give me self-control. The Lord is telling you all those things, you have it inside of you. All those things that you are asking, ask for something else, I'm just waiting. 
Because what you are asking right now, you already have it inside of you. Now you must manifest whatever you have inside of you. You already have joy. Lord, I'm always alone. I don't have joy. You already have joy inside of you. You already have peace inside of you. Lord, please give me peace. No, you already have peace inside of you. Lord, give me faith. You already have it inside of you. I was one of me with patience. In, fre- in my language, they call it In my language, you say uh, put a seed today and rip it today. Too fast. Fast food. <laughs> my crave. Comme un I like the thing. So I was like, Lord, give, give me patience because me, I know myself. I am so sure, hot, hot, in the good sense. Amen. I am the quick, quick. Hallelujah. But in that kingdom, you must go with, you must learn patience. Hallelujah. Because what, when you, you reap from patience, it's much better. Because the fast food Parce que être rapide dans are not good for your health. You know it. Every if you put in the microwave and you want it for, inside, it's still cold. So I was praying, Lord, give me patience. Give me self-control. No, the Lord was telling me all this time. Le Seigneur m'a dit. I don't need to give you those kind of things. It's in your DNA. You have it inside of you. So now, how to 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 recognize? How to 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 see the manifestation? How to see it materialize in your life? First of all, for those who are taking notes, you recognize your your identity in Christ. You must know who you are in Christ. You must know where you stand. And I want to have three persons. I need me in three. If I can have three volunteers, please. So I think that by now you know already. Je sais que vous me connaissez. It's like my husband. We were t- I was talking with my husband. Je à mon mari. And he was telling me, and then he was telling me, you, uh, oh, but this is the flesh. And I, oh, are you talking like that? Because this is your new language. You are now flesh, soul, spirit. And I was laughing because indeed, when he was saying that, I was also preparing that. So I was, this one is just the man of my life. Amen. Amen. So, Elder Mapuza, future pastor. Notre pasteur, uh, notre futur pasteur. Amen. Amen. Our future elder. Notre futur ancien. And our future. I don't want to prophesy today. Amen. Prophesy, please. Amen. Yeah. So, this is me. C'est moi. One. And you know the story. You know already. You can even call me. Tu peux même appeler. Spirit, soul, body. Esprit. I understand. Et je I will be happy because I will know that you understand the concept. This is me, one, but this is me in three. In me, I have my spirit. I have the body. I have the soul. So here, I'm a new creature. So I gave my life to Jesus. So I must know where I stand. I am a child of God. I am now a member of the family of God. The DNA of my father standing here. So you don't come and tell me you hey, 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 I have the DNA. I, when we sing, I know who I am. I know indeed who I am. I have the DNA of God inside of me. Now I must renew every day. I renew my mind. I renew my mind because I was used to always follow my body, my emotion, and everything. Now I must teach myself to no more lean to my flesh. My my flesh, but always my spirit. Because here I have the glory, I have the Holy Spirit, I have the plenitude. 
the fullness of God inside of me. Amen. Amen. So I must know who I am. Je dois the same way God loves Jesus. He loves me. I must know where I'm standing. But also, the second point is, you must respond to his lordship and walk in, in the spirit. For that, you, for that, you will excuse myself. Let me remove my shoes to go now. Hallelujah. When we gave our life to Jesus, and we say, I receive you as my Lord and my Savior, our own nature, we give him to him. It means that we surrender. We are saying, we surrender, nous nous abandonnons to him. We are telling God that this is me. This is my life. I give you now the, the will, the volant, the will of my life. Because two persons can drive this car. Two persons can drive this car. So now I surrender myself to your authority. So I give you. I even want to sing a song. But it's, it's my mother tongue. So I will not sing that song. Because you will not understand. For you, I will sing in tongues. For you, I will sing in tongues. Amen. So I will give you the will of my life. I surrender to your lordship. It's no more about me. About what I feel. Because this is how I used to be. When I was there. But now it's all about you. Look, looking at you. So the second point, you must respond to his lordship and walk in the spirit. Hallelujah. Amen. We are not allowed to leave the flesh to the, 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 the body, the flesh to, 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 to go with us whatever we want to go. No more our own desires. No more the desire of the flesh. But we are going with the desire of the spirit. The spirit of God will live inside of us. Why? Because in Galatians chapter 5 verse 16. The Bible says. But I say. Walk habitually. This is IMP version. Um, Amplify version. But I say, walk habitually in the Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. Seek Cherche. him and be responsive to his guidance. Et à sa What he's telling you. Te dit. And then you will certainly not carry out the desire of the sinful nature. Yes. Which responds impulsively and passively. Thank you. Without regard for God and his precepts. So when I'm following the desire Quand je suis le désir of the flesh, de la chair, it's not in regard for God and his precepts. C est, c est pas par à Dieu. It's about me and what I feel. Par à moi ce que je for the sinful nature, la nature I'm reste. here. The sinful nature has its desire which is opposed to the spirit. And the desire of the spirit opposes the sinful nature. So we are here. The spirit. No, no, no. Look that side. And the, the flesh. So we are like this. Your sinful nature, it's opposed to the spirit, the, 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 the thing of the spirit. So now I'm at verse 17 now. To the sinful nature and the spirit are in direct opposition. Continually in conflict. So that you as a believer, you do not do whatever you want to do. Listen what the uh, um, uh, patient version says. When your self-life craves the things that offend the Holy Spirit, 
quand ton corps se languit des choses qui attristent le Saint Esprit. So when you always on, you know, and I will read for you those kind of things. It's in the Him, in the, the Holy Spirit now, who's inside of you, from living free within you. De vivre pleinement à l'intérieur de toi. And the Holy Spirit intense cravings. So when you like the things of the Holy Spirit, you want to follow the Holy Spirit. That cravings now for the Holy Spirit hinder your self life from dominating you. So when you say to yourself, I can't, I can't. Yes, you can't because you lean on yourself. But when you look at the thing of the Spirit, the Holy Spirit, you can. Because it's not you, but it will. The Holy Spirit will hinder you. Hallelujah. So that the two incompatible and conflicted forces within you are your self life and the flesh, and the new creation life of the Spirit. So inside of you, you have those. Fight every day. But if your life, 18 now, are guided and led by the Spirit, you are not subject to the law. Now the practice of sinful nature are clearly evident. Let me tell you now the practice of the sinful nature. They are sexual immorality. The la chair. They are les choses de la chair. They are sexual immorality, impurity, sensuality, total irresponsibility, lack of self-control, idolatry, sorcery, hostility, strife, jealousy, fit of anger, despite. Dissension, division, division, faction, envy, darkness, righteous, beha righteous behavior, and other things like this. I warn you beforehand, just as I did previously, that those who practice these things, who take my thing far away, for those who practice this such of thing will not inherit the kingdom of God. Can I have the pulpit here? Will not, no, no, we will not inherit the kingdom of God. The Bible is not telling us that we will not enter the kingdom because when you gave your life to Jesus, you are already in the kingdom of God. But he tells you that you will not have the blessings. You will not have the blessings. Why? Because the children, the Bible says in Galatians chapter 4, verse 1, children will not inherit. Because as long as the children is a child, it's like a slave. Though all everything is for him. Bien que tout lui appartienne, il ne va pas hériter. Bien que tout lui appartienne, parce que c'est un enfant. Because he's a child. And child have childish attitude. Child has childish attitude. An enfant a des attitudes d'enfant. A child will go with the emotions. You will look at the child today is happy. You give him a sweet, he's happy. You take back the sweet, he starts crying. So the emotion, the emotion are up and down. They will not. Um, they will. They will do things, but they will not think about the consequences of the things they are doing. This is a child. This is an immature person. I can't give you. You can't inherit it right now because you are still a child. You can't have the blessing because you are still a child. You will waste the, the, the blessing. And it, this reminds me myself. I told you lately I had a story. When I went to take... I when I went to take my, my daughter at school, 
she came back and she was crying, crying. And I was like, why are you crying? Because that lady, she started explaining to me. I was like, Ugh. Don't mess with my children. I went to myself as I thought that I was clever. And the mother was with her, the ch that girl was with her mother. And I went. I said, you can mess with all the children in this school, but don't mess with mine. You know, do you know me? I start, you know, to put everything, you know, with my bad English. I went all over. For her to understand, next time, don't touch what is mine. And then I went. And then I talked to my husband. I, I think you know the story. And then he told me, go back and ask for forgiveness. Go and apologize. What is this? And then when I was preparing my message, I was so, you know, disturbed. Because I was so immature. This is a childless attitude full of flesh F myself me you will know you will see not me you will my church ma, ma, me, me me myself and my. no no it was all about me what I feel I was thinking that I am a gang now they know me in that school if they try they will see immaturity Immaturity. Immaturity. Childish way. I have a DNA. I am a child of God. When you press me, whatever must come out of me is Jesus. When you press me, the juice that must come out of me is Jesus. They press me and the juice that came out of me was proud. It was proud, uh, full of me, full of challenge. I was thinking that, yes, but I was showing how much I am still a child. And a child cannot inherit. When the life will press you, every day we are pressing. Every day the life is pressing you. Wanted to show you that the real nature of you is your flesh. But we know where we stand. We are children of God. And we, we, we must inherit our inheritance. We must have our blessings. Lately, I preach about take your possession. As long as you are a child, a child, a child can't take his possession. You must be an adult. You must be guided by the Spirit of the God. Hallelujah. As long as you are still driving your car. As long as you are still driving, you are in opposition with the Spirit of God. Oh no, I can't forget that person. Never. You are still in your flesh. Because it's still, it's still you. When they press, mm, hey, don't go there. It's still you. A problem. You go. You show people. They will know who I am. Who you are? Do we need to know who you are? There are people who will never open the Bible. The only Bible they will open it's you. The only occasion that they will have to see Jesus, it will be through your life. And you, you want to show them you? Who you are? How strong you are? How your English is nice? How your French is nice? How you can stand for your children? When the life press you, the juice that might come out is Jesus. People must see Jesus. They must see Jesus. Because the DNA that you have, the gene that they must see, it's love, it's patience, it's kindness, it's faithfulness, it's meekness, it's self-control. Not, oh, I'm a gang, this is me. This is not you. This is not you. The devil is a liar. This is not you. You have the, the ADN, the DNA of the Lord. Hallelujah. They must see God. They must see God. 
When I was preparing my message, I was message, thinking about myself. Je, uh, je à how many person, I, how many time, how many people I present myself to them? Uh, combien, uh, de personnes, uh, comment je me suis présenté aux gens? Instead of presenting God, instead of presenting Jesus, I don't need to say I'm a child of God. Look at Jesus. No. In my action, my action will show this is Jesus gene. This is, this is God gene. I can't see God through you. I told you, I told you the story. When I went to my, uh, I told you the story when I went to abro abortion. And when, and when I told my husband, I tell you, and he told me, you know, the Lord loves you so much. And at that time, I was prepared for the separation. I, I was prepared to lead to him. So I prepared myself tonight. We will break up. So I'm ready. He's a man of God. I'm giving him all my 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 past, my messed up past. So today it's the day for the breaking day. So I prepare myself. You know, when you you want to act spiritual, you fast. Lord, give me the strength so I can talk. So I prepare myself. And when I, I start explaining to him and blah, 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 blah with the, look, listen to the introduction. I'm a new creature, born, a new creature, born, have a new spirit, I'm a child of God. But before me to be a new creature, you must know that I was a, the kind of sinner I was. And I start explaining to him. And then we talk, and then I explain to him. And then he told me, one friend, it's a, the Lord loves you. Dieu and I love you. And he started talking. And the only thing I was seeing, it was Jesus. The only thing I was seeing, it was Jesus loves. La seule chose que je vois, that he took a sinner as you are Il a pris une que tu étais. and he's telling you I know your life, your past I know je your past but I want you as you are Mais je veux que tu and tu as I was talking with my husband I was only see Jesus until today when we have something something happened I can look at him or listen to him and I'm listening, I'm listening to Jesus Jesus but you Tell me, when you stand, when you, you open your mouth or when you close your mouth, did they see you or they see Jesus? As I read the verse, the Lord wants us to be as he is, as Jesus is. Even after this message, when we, you will go out, the world will press you. Situations, problems, they will press you from everywhere. Hallelujah. But you must be able to show Jesus. You must be aware that in that bus, it's not no more about me. But I give you everything. As my Lord and my Savior, I give you everything. So now, guide my life. It's not about the, the Spirit is telling you, go in left. You are telling the Holy Spirit. No, I think, I went this, I think this would be before. We must go right. He's telling you. And you is telling him. I can't forget this one, but not this one, no. The Holy Spirit is telling you, forgive. I know why I'm telling you to forgive. But you are giving the Holy Spirit the explanation. I know why I can't forgive this person. Kaka, who is driving you, your, your life? You are the Holy Spirit. Tonight, today you must repent. Repent because you are still uh, driving your own life. You must say to the Lord, Lord, I give you the well, 
the wheel. Take the wheel. Hallelujah. Take the lead. Where must I go? If you want me to forgive, don't even ask if you want me to forgive. Because you, you know the answer. He wants you to forgive. 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 I don't know why I'm still in the forgiveness thing. Maybe you have a situation. Who you have someone inside of you. Like, no, no, no. Everybody but not that person. Now the Holy Spirit is telling you. It's that person. It's about that person. He's even telling you, pray for that person. Pray for that person. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The way for you to manifest the fruit of the Spirit. And in the family. In certain family. Thank you. Thank you, Spirit, soul, and body. Can we clap up for our bodies? And you know in certain family, you can see certain features are very strong. Amen. Even the way the, 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 the boy is walking. It's like the father. Even if the father passed away long, you know, long time ago. But the way the, the, that young boy is walking, it's like the father. And you can even tell when you see a person, this one is laughing exactly as a mother. Or exactly as a father. You know those kind of things that you can easily, you know the gene when the gene are very strong. But the, the other one that develop themselves when they stay, people stay together in a family. My last born, born Daniela, because in my house, because they are born here, they speak English in my house because I like French. So in my house, we, we speak French. So my husband has a, 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 a word that he likes to say, a phrase. When you do that, ah, non, tu blague. Uh, you, are, you are joking. Yeah. No, you are, you are joking. And lately, I was talking with my last born, and we were talking, and she told me, Ah, no, you are joking. I was writing, and I said, Hey, 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 this is your dad? This is daddy. This is. I was like, You see? It's not that she's not born with the language, but because she's used to stay with her daddy. Now, even, even the way her daddy talk, she talk in the same way. And in French, I was talking to, oh, you know, this is a, no, mommy, you are, no, no, you're joking. With the expression and everything, it was a dad. Sometimes we are not strong in maybe me, I was no self control with, and me. Ooh. You can find me in love, maybe kindness from time to time. Self control and Mais patience. Et la ah! hey! <laughs> but what you can do, Mais que tu peux faire? because you have it in you, you have toi. the fruit of the Spirit. De, why? Because, de, de why? Because you have that DNA in Parce you. Que tu as cette ADN so toi. you have patience in tu you, you have self control. Now, the more time you spend with plus, the Holy Spirit, plus tu passes du temps avec le Saint -Esprit, the more you are developing now plus tu develop, those kind of things that you know yourself you were not able to do by yourself. Tu, tu seras pas capable de faire, de now I can now I can testify. Je I don't know if it's too early to testify, but I testify that now I'm really working on patience. Mais je travaille sur la patience. This is why I'm, even when we are praying and we will stand up on our feet and we will pray because you know and I want no one if we can have Galatians chapter 5 verse 22 and you know yourself, you know your life you know how you are you know where you are strong because my, but the first question is there is someone here who never gave his life to Jesus just wave. We are family. Don't be ashamed. Just wave. We will lead you to our Father. Amen. Because all of us, we gave our lives to Jesus. It means that all of us, we have the Holy Spirit. All of us, we have the DNA. But I must think that all of us, we are not 100%. 
You know, some some things are stronger than other. You know your life. You know how you are. Now we are going to pray. And you will ask the Lord. Lord, help me to manifest in my life peace. Help me to manifest joy. Help me to manifest kindness. Help me to manifest. Now you know yourself. Now pray. Close your eyes and ask the Lord. Lord, help me to manifest the fruit of the Spirit. Help me to manifest the fruit of the Spirit. Help me to manifest the fruit of the Spirit in my life. Help me to manifest the fruit of the Spirit in my life. Help me to love because because love will help you to forgive that person. So ask the Lord to help you. No, and if I can have 22. Ask, ask, ask. Lord, I want to manifest. I want to manifest more patience. I want to manifest more kindness. I want to manifest more gentleness. I want to manifest more peace. I want to manifest joy. I want to manifest faithfulness. I want to manifest meekness. I want to manifest self-control. I want to manifest you. I want people to see you through me. I want people to see you through me. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. The prayer that you are doing now will open doors for you to possess your inheritance. What you are doing now will open up doors for you to possess your inheritance. Lord, I want more of you in my life. I want more of you in my life. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Can we clap our hand for Jesus? Can we clap our hand for Jesus? Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you. You can have your seat. You can have your seat. And for today, you can forget everything. But remember, when you will come out in this place, they will squeeze you. Life will squeeze you. But remind yourself who you are. The DNA that you have. You have God's DNA. When they will squeeze you, show them God. They must test and see that the Lord is good through your life. Amen. 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 So now I'll ask the media to show us the video. Because we are at the end of our service. I just want to emphasize of the program that we'll have uh, last week, uh, next week. And the angel of the house, Pastor Daniel, for those who, those who don't know him, maybe you will see him for the f- your first time. Hallelujah. Amen. We want to listen what he wants to say to us. Thanks to all of you, church. I can't tell you how much I miss being with you week after week. But I'm glad. This week, I'm looking forward to being with you. Next Sunday, we are going to have a special service. We are not going to be meeting here. We are going to be meeting in Rheinberg. We're going to join our sister church, Logos Rema in Rheinberg. And we're going to have a combined service. It's going to be very powerful. And I want you to join us 9 o'clock in the morning. So that's 
that. It's not our usual time, but please let's leave as early as possible. By the way, in that service, there will also be an ordination and consecration of the ministers that are serving with us here at Logo Summer South. It's going to be amazing. I'm looking forward to that. So for the details of this week on how it's going to go, please speak to Lady Belinda and to Elder Mabuza for the details, because even during the week, we are having rallies there, having meetings there. I want you to join us. Sunday is going to be special, special, special. Please don't miss it. If you have any logistic problem, transportation issue, please chat to Lady Belinda and to Elder Mabuza. We're going to make sure that we are a hand of help. We are a hand of association so that together we can celebrate the Lord uh, and give Him glory. So it's going to be an amazing time. Don't miss it for anything. Hey, listen to them and speak to them about the rest of the program. I'm looking forward to seeing you this week. God bless you. Chat soon. Amen. I think that we have done with the live. The 